I went to the doctors to have a fatty cyst removed off my right shoulder. And when we went in there, he was a bit iffy on it. So he decided to send it off for testing. And two weeks later, it came back as stage three melanoma. That was a bit of a surprise. Got me a referral down to Westmead and had surgery to remove the rest of it and also remove all the lymph nodes under my right arm because it had spread. And now I do 12 months worth of immunotherapy with all the doctors in Westmead. I think the scariest moment was hearing the doctor sort of say, oh, so you have melanoma, which is cancer, because obviously the cancer word is scary. I was like, I have to tell my family. So I have to ring my mom and I have to ring my dad. And we are a close family, even though we don't live close. And we've had a lot of, over our years, we've had our fair share of traumatic events. So that was probably a scary thing for me was actually telling my mum and dad and my brothers and sisters that I have a form of cancer that we have to deal with. I'm 35, born in Sydney, grew up in the Hunter Valley and moved to Gunnedah three years ago. Love netball, oldest of six. Let's use up a lot of my annual leave driving to Sydney. It's also, especially the way the world is at the moment, it's also very costly. So financially, it's a massive impact. Also the fatigue from the treatment itself and then driving. I think had I lived anywhere else, the treatment probably would have been easier and more accessible because you're so much closer to these really big, well-known cancer centres with all of the history. It's harder because the facilities aren't out here. You know, had I lived in Sydney, I would have been able to go to the hospital of a morning, have treatment, be back at my home that night, be back at work the next day, whereas now it's a two to three day turnaround. When I first heard about Can Assist, I jumped on the website and realised that it was quite a big thing across, across New South Wales, and then realised that they were actually local branches and all the money that was raised locally was given back locally. We filled out the little online form and after, I think it was not even a full day, I got a, a phone call from Can Assist in Canada to meet and see how they could help. And we went and met at the local coffee shop and had a chat and that's where everything started. And they told me how they could help me, helped me with some fuel vouchers, which has been great traveling to and from Sydney every month and also assisting me with my rent. It made me feel like a family away from family. So even when I didn't have anyone close or I didn't have anyone to help, it's not just the financial assistance, but also just the way they actually care about you as a person.